Hello and welcome back to the channel. I'm going to tone it down a bit and give you all something positive. Um, I do love to share positive stories because it, it helps us to see that there are other things as well happening in the world. Now, this came by request from one of my viewers by the name of Ashley. She wanted me to give a shout out uh, to um, a page that she found on Facebook. It's called Brown Girl Beekeeping. So, I decided to go and take a look at Brown Girl Beekeeping on Facebook and I was very impressed by this young woman's work. Uh, she's into gardening and anyone who knows me knows that I love gardening. That's my thing right there. Um, uh, she's talking about her seeds. She's showing some of her crops. Um, I wish I can show this young lady, Ashley, my um, seed drawer, my seed collection, <laughs> you know, because I have a collection. As I've stated before, I collect seeds the way some women collect shoes and purses because that is my passion. That is what I love to do. Um, I want to become the best that I can be at this with the hands and the help of the Most High, of course. But um, I just wanted to shout out to this page because whenever I see a young person uh, doing something like this, growing food, planting, beekeeping. I'm not even beekeeping yet. I would like to get into that. Um, but it's very inspiring to see someone young doing this. Um, some time ago, I shared a story of a young man. Um, he said, G's up, holes down. And he was talking about um, a garden hoe, okay? And uh, he was showing all of what he was growing in his urban inner city garden. And I'm telling you, everything was looking so lush and big and beautiful. I was so impressed by it. And so I don't know anything about this young lady other than uh, what I see her doing here. Someone shared her page and wanted me to um, highlight this. Um, I think young people really need to get on board with this sort of thing. This young woman is very young and she's out here growing her own food. And she seems to be very passionate about it. Um, she seems to be very happy to be doing this. I'm sitting here looking at um, her hand holding some broccoli and some cauliflower and I am tripping out on how beautiful those those vegetables look very impressive very impressive so um, you all should go on over to her page um, if I remember I will leave a link if I don't remember someone please remind me if I don't see your reminder just look up brown girl beekeeping on Facebook you will see her page and you will see some very impressive stuff going on over there. She's growing really big food and uh, it looks very healthy as well. And I'm just loving it. When I see young people doing this sort of thing, this means they get it. They get it. They know what's happening. They see what's going on. And they are not going to be sitting by twiddling their thumbs, trying to figure out where their next meal is coming from, making excuses. They're not going to do that. They're going to be making progress while others are making excuses. So I am very happy to see this. Again, I don't know anything else about the young lady other than what I'm looking at here on the page. I just encourage her to continue to do this, continue to grow food, okay? Continue to encourage others to grow food. Um, I'm just very impressed. I don't even know what else to say beyond that because um, I think this is something that we definitely must get into. We can't afford not to do this. You can't afford not to. This is a must, okay? So scoot on over to her page on Facebook. I don't know if she has a channel at all uh, here on YouTube, but I do see the page on Facebook, okay? That being said, see if you can find some type of encouragement over there because this young woman is making it happen. She's beekeeping. Oh my goodness, beekeeping. And she's growing food. I'm looking at that ginger. Kind of reminds me of some of my ginger crops. Um, I did a video some time ago where I said, you don't have to buy ginger ever again. And what I meant by that was, as long as you have them rooted in the ground, we have them inside. We brought them inside for the winter, but as long as you have them rooted in the ground, they will keep on spreading as long as they have somewhere to spread. So grow it in pots, you see. Um, 
I'm telling you, this is what we all need to be doing. We need to be handling our business, growing our own food, uh, raising our own livestock, bees, everything. This is what we need to be doing. No more excuses, but make it happen. Start making it happen. Well, I'm done with this video. I hope you get some type of encouragement from it. This is a young woman. Uh, so that means we are without excuse. If a young lady can do this, then some of you older people can get out there and do it too. Especially seeing that we are living in, living in some very strange times. Okay? That being said, we need to make it happen. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Share and like this video. And with that, I am out. Be sure to ring the bell to be notified of new uploads on this channel. And also, comment, share, like, and subscribe.